First of all, welcome to the to the Welsh setup. How how do you feel? Still a bit of starstruck to be fair. Walking in, seeing the boys, just it's a massive massive achievement. It shows that like luckily the mum's got a nice Welsh connection there. Isn't it? Did you feel uh, do you feel nervous in any way when you were coming when you were coming down here? Um, to be fair, I don't really get ne get nervous, but it's like obviously new environment. New, new goals for well, set myself and yeah for me I just can't wait to get, to get playing really. In terms of it's been quite a journey for you, I mean you're still young, you're 22 still, but it's been quite a journey for you, West Ham then being in non-league and now um, back in, 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 in with Huddersfield it seems to, a lot of things have happened. Yeah it feels like everything's just happened so quick. Um, I remember uh, talking to my mate when the, when the call-up got announced I remember talking to my man, he was just like making me realise that nine months ago he was playing non-league football and now you're going to play with Aaron Ramsey. Do you know what I mean? So like a lot has changed from that from the, since that nine months and yeah, I just I never probably never would have thought it would come this soon. I just thought to myself, you know, like this year work hard and then maybe next season it might come, but it's come and yeah, I'm really excited. How would you define training this morning? You've taken part in your first session. Yeah, it was, everything was obviously, it's just, everything's just so professional here. And um, yeah, it's just like getting to know some of the boys as well, which was good. My mum's from uh, Newport. So um, yeah, that's where it's really come from, to be honest. And um, yeah, obviously nearly every summer I'm down here, down in Wells. Most people might know it's Puff Core. Yeah. So I'm down there, the Coney Beach, always there. So. Yeah, I see Danny a lot, but yeah, the most questions have come from my mum. And I th it's fair to say, I think you've made no secret of the fact of your desire to, to represent your, your, your country and f from your mother's side. Yeah, of course, obviously, since young, I've always said, like, if I ever make it into the big time, I've always wanted to play for Wales. It was never no doubt for me. It was always, I want to play for Wales, I want to play for Wales. And as soon as I got the move to Huddersfield, straight away f said to my agent, like, make sure I'm down for Wales not for England or anything else. I want to be down for Wales so I can play and do you know I mean? make a, a long, long dream to all. As a club, I just feel they've had a decent start to the season. You've had a good start. You were named BFL Championship Player of the, of the, of the Month. Um, how would you describe yourself as a player, those who might not have seen you play? Um, I, like to, I like to be the last name on the fans' tongues when they leave the stadium. I like to excite people when they're in the stadium. and. The good thing as well is I, I just be me. Like if you know me, I play. F I leave everything out there on the pitch. Um, I play for the badge, whether it's the Huddersfield badge or the Welsh badge. Um, I play for the badge, and yeah, I, I work hard. And yeah, like I said, like, I just like to excite the crowd.